Sevilla go for this lineup. Vatslik keeps goal. Carlos, Teresa, Jesus Navas, Escudero, Rakitic, Fernando, Renega, Ronnie Lopez, Gomez, the young tasked with leading the line. Gets things running. Balls out on the left now. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. It's not taken him long, and that's going to be a booking. And that's out of reach. Ronnie Lopez tries to stroke it through. Great ball to play him in, but he will be gutted to miss that. Oh, that was a lovely little dink over the top just to get the runner in on the keeper. And what a pity he just couldn't produce a goal from that. Well, I think the early signs have been very good for them. They've already got that defence on settle, and now they've got to back it up. Gomez, Fernando. Now it's Jesus Navas. Joaquin looking up to see who wants it. Cariso battles to win it back. Gomez. Played it early. Ambitious to say the least, he seemed to be in a hurry to get that. Canales demanding a quick ball here. What a throw in. Fernando goes long and forward. Gomez. Out to the flank. He's dealt with that well. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Carlos Elena. Fakir. Banega. And it's Lopez. To throw in. Mondi. Joaquin. And it's half time here. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change perhaps after half time. That's the start of the second half. Sevilla playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline converting chances would make a world of difference for them Rakitic pulls loose who's getting there oh and they really should have been made to pay 
Oh, look, I don't need to tell you that that is not a good area to lose possession in. And should it be repeated, I think there's a real chance that the next time they're going to be punished for it. Who's going to make this theirs? Christian Teo. And he's made certain that won't get through. Seems now to be all about wits. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Luke de Jong, now the pass. Fence has got rid of that. Fernando, good challenge, he just stood firm. Fernando really struggling to influence the game. Well, he appears to be singled out. Oh, it's a foul there, right on the edge of the box. And the referee has given a free kick just outside the box. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. Real chance! It's gone a long way up and away. Oh, checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Spoon forward. A foul, simple decision for the referee. Well, that's a booking, always looked it. And it's Navas, tries a through ball. Yes, another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves. Yeah, I think the problem there was that the pass was, was telegraphed. An easy read for the defence. Banega is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Peter, I can't stress enough the need to get to this fella quickly. They can save themselves a whole lot of hassle. Munir tries to get it forward quickly. De Jong brings the ball forward. Locks it towards the front. And it's Munir. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Now it's Luke de Jong drilled in low. There is the final whistle. A uh, frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defence is broadly in charge, and it has finished goalless. Well, how will we look back on that? Yeah, I think the first.